South Korea's government is engaged in a political fight with a large religious group and it's threatening efforts to contain a fresh coronavirus outbreak. Infections were first reported among members of the Sarangjil Church on August 12th. Just days after, the church's leader, John Gwang Hoon, and others took part in a massive anti-government rally in Seoul. John later tested positive for the virus and the health ministry filed a complaint against him. They said he ignored social distancing instructions by attending the event, which the church denies. Authorities have also accused the group of spreading falsehoods about the disease and of not handing over complete lists of its members. As of Thursday, at least 739 people affiliated with the church have tested positive, according to health authorities. In response, church members say they are victims of a politically motivated witch hunt. The church said it had already provided full lists, but health authorities have accused them of underreporting its membership. This is not the first religious group to cause controversy around the virus in South Korea. Earlier this year, the Shinjongi Church of Jesus was involved in the country's first major outbreak and accounted for almost a third of total cases. Its leader was arrested after being accused of hindering the virus response by hiding information about the church's members and gatherings, which he denies.